guys what's up welcome to this new video guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you exactly how to link your paypal account to your pioneer now a lot of things has changed and i've been receiving a lot of messages from you guys telling me that you are finding it difficult for you to link your paypal account to your pioneer account and that's why i'm making this video now i know i've made a video about showing you guys how to link pioneer to paypal and the rest of them but this video is going to be different i'm going to walk you through everything you need to know and um, some of the pros and cons and everything you need to know about it so make sure you're subscribed to the channel turn on the bell icon so if you haven't you know done all the stuff and please like this video so that this video is going to reach out to as many people that um, are interested in learning how to link their paypal account to their pioneer account now to do that of course you need to have a paypal business account like you see on my screen right here this is my paypal business account and i've done a lot of businesses with this paypal account and of course you need to have a pioneer account now make sure you have you have these two accounts and you have verified them okay so now for you to link your paypal to your pioneer you need to make sure this accounts are verified now for before i show you exactly how to link your paypal to your pioneer i need to show you some things okay so right now as you can see here i just have a total zero 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 balance now but that does not say that i've not received money in this account now if i go to account activities and um, go to transactions okay as you can see here i've received some money here this is from paypal this is from paypal this is from paypal and this is when i withdrew to my nigerian bank account okay so this account has done some transactions and as you can see these are paypal transactions so this actually works okay so for some of you it might be finding it difficult for you to link your account and as you can see here this is my name king gobina that to show you that this money came from this my paypal account king gobina as you can see on the screen so right now you need to do some things for you to be able to successfully link these two accounts now what you need to do is on your paypal account you just need to go to this paid and get paid section now go to this banks and card section now once you go there it's going to show you the money page now this is the money page right now now what we need to do is to scroll down and uh, once you scroll down you're going to see that i've linked two accounts now this is my pioneer this is my grill okay let's still scroll down so i'll show you now this is my grill the first one is for grill um i'll show you grill later and this is my pioneer account now before i show you exactly how to link it i want to correct some notions okay so some of you that are having issues linking these two accounts now obviously you need to have patience for these two accounts to link okay i got some messages people telling me that um when they try to link it paypal tell them it's a virtual account yes these are virtual accounts and yes it's linked as you can see mine is linked it's a virtual account okay and this also one this other one grill is also a virtual account and it's linked so even if it's a virtual account that doesn't mean it's not going to link so you just need to make sure you are doing the right thing now one of the right thing you need to do is if you open a new paypal account don't expect paypal to link your bank account to your paypal okay so, so for some people that actually works so fast and um, for most people it won't work because your paypal account is new you need to carry out some transactions okay so make sure you have done some transactions sending even if it's one dollar you know into your paypal account make sure you have some transactions now once you've done that part another thing you need to do is make sure your pioneer account as well is legit and verified and it's having almost or same name with your paypal account as you can see here this is my real name and if i go to my pioneer you also find my real name in those account details okay so make sure it's having same name and um, there's nothing wrong with your account and if you try it one two times it doesn't work you need to have patience so as to retry it again and have patience retry it again before you then contact customer service okay so this is my own one cent and i've showed it to you and i've you know explained it to you right now now to link the account once you are once you go to this paid and get paid section go to banks and cards then on your pay in your account let's go to home you want to make sure you're at home then you're going to see your balances right here so what you need to do is to click on this um okay click on get speed so that we are going to get the details of our accounts then click on receiving accounts 
now once you click on receiving account it's going to ask you to select the account as you can see here i have um these two accounts so i'll just click on usa this is the us dollars account so just click on view details now once we have the details this is what we are going to be using in order for us to link it to paypal like now this is the interface so what you want to do is you probably won't have any bank linked so you just need to click on link a new bank now once you click on link a new bank it's going to pull up this stuff right here so what you want to do right now is to copy these details and paste it right here on your paypal account okay so the first thing we need to copy is the routing number now if you look down here you're going to find the routing number just copy this routing number click on it and it's going to be copied then come back here and paste it Control v i pasted the routing number and immediately pull up the name of the bank community federal savings bank now i forgot i forgot to show you something now before you even go ahead linking this account okay please make sure you do this stuff before you go ahead linking this account you need to make sure that let's view details you need to make sure that the bank you're linking is community federal savings bank now if it's not community federal savings bank what you need to do is to click on this solution guide right here below here so make sure if it's any other bank that is not community federal savings bank make sure you take this step before you go ahead linking so make sure to click on solution guide so once you click on solution guide it's going to pull up this stuff for you so it's going to tell you i'm unable to use my receiving account with paypal stripe or other payment providers this one is um these other options are not for us so this first one is for us because we are unable to use it so just click on it and it's going to ask you to replace your existing receiving account with one from an issuing bank that should work with paypal stripe or other payment providers so what you want to do right now is to click on this next um button okay so you can also see their recommendation they say we also recommend reviewing our tips on using your receiving account with paypal and stripe so you can go ahead and um, view their tips you can open it and go ahead to read what they have to you know what their recommendations are as you can see i just opened it and um, you can just go ahead to read up but that's not an issue so right now you just need to click on this next button and what it's going to do is it's going to replace the account you have which is not community federal savings account is going to replace it with a community federal savings account now once you've done this step then we need to go back right here we need to go back to this paid and get paid section and um, click on receiving account and confirm that we have the community federal savings account now now once we have the community federal service account now we can continue so the first thing is copy our routing number and paste it which i've pasted then the next thing is copy our account number so right now where is the account number okay this is the account number just copy the account number come here and paste it right here on paper Control v now once that is done the next thing we need to do is to click on link your bank now for two two things are going to happen if you click on this link your bank first thing is either they accept it immediately without any issues or secondly they tell you that um you're unable to link your bank now that you should contact customer support now once you get that message please leave it alone okay don't try to link it again so to so us to avoid issues because it has failed then it's not going to work immediately again so just leave it for a while then try it after 24 hours try to link it again if you get the same email or message leave it again try it after another 24 hours trying to link it again now if you have these issues for three days consecutively then you need to contact customer support tell them tell them you are unable to link your bank to your paypal account don't them don't don't just immediately tell them it's a virtual account just tell them you're unable to link your bank account to your paypal account now they are going to look at the issues and they could solve it for you now if for adventure they tell you anything just leave it keep on trying it with intervals don't try it simultaneously with intervals eventually it's going to work because this is actually something that one of my students has done and he has showed a lot of testimonies for me on my whatsapp which i'm not going to show you right now but he, has, he told me this how he was able to get his account linked and um, a whole lot of people as well not holding him i've gotten a lot of messages you know 
people that tried initially and they were unable to link it then after some successful uh, some other trials they were able to link it so if this method should work for you just tell me in the comment section don't forget to like this video subscribe to this channel because i drop videos here to help you okay so this is what i do and uh, i believe it's going to work for you because actually it has actually worked for me and i, I linked my two bank the one from paypal and the one from payoneer and the one from grill now a quick notice i'm going to show you something about grill right now i know this video is about linking your paypal account to your grill um, linking your paypal account to your payoneer account but i want to show you something real quick now this platform is grill.co now this is grill.co and this this platform almost does the same thing payoneer is going to be doing for you it's going to allow you to withdraw your money into this grill and into this platform you can then withdraw to your bank account immediately now i'm going to do a separate video showing you all those processes but i just want to show you something real quick now if i go to this pioneer section right now and go to um if i go to this pioneer section and go to account activities okay and go to transactions you're going to see these transactions that i've done now this one i will draw you to my bank account which is 84 dollars now let's view this transaction so that you're going to see exactly what i'm showing you now this is 84 dollars and i transferred it into my nigerian bank account and this is the amount i received let me go back so i received a total amount of 34,816 naira at Cobo. So this is the amount I received because I transferred this money from Payunia to my bank account in Nigeria. Now the same $84 if I try to transfer it to this platform called Grill and um, transfer it from this Grill to my bank account, I'm going to be receiving $49, as uh, 49,000 Naira. As you can see right here, this is it for US dollars. This is the currency converter. It's four US dollars is to is going to be forty nine thousand eight hundred and twelve Nigerian naira. Now, why is that so? That is so because the exchange rate, as of the time I'm recording this video right now, is five hundred and ninety three naira per dollar. That is what they buy your dollar from you. Whereas Payunia is very different. It's still for four hundred and something. Okay, so this platform is one of the best way to withdraw your PayPal funds. Anyway, if you're in Nigeria, okay, if you're in Nigeria, you want to withdraw your PayPal phone, just link this grill account to your pay you to your PayPal account. But that is different, okay. That is of this video. I'm going to be showing you exactly how to make it and how to do it, to go about everything in another video. So for in today's video, I believe you enjoyed the video and you have seen exactly how to link your Payoneer account to your PayPal or how to link PayPal to your Payoneer. Now, if you have any issues at all, tell me in the comment section and I'll be glad to make the video for you. Okay, so this actually works for me and I wish and I believe it's going to work for you. Now, please take note of all these things I've explained to you in this video for you to be able to have your account set up the right way. Okay, so if you have any issues, like I said, tell me in the comment section, like this video, subscribe to the channel turn on the bell notification icon so that you get notified whenever a new content goes live on this channel so guys i'll see you guys in my next video what i want you to do right now is to go and take action immediately so they are going to see results thank you very much i'll see you guys in my next video